What's up guys, my name is Anil and in this Laravel live wire video tutorial we will see what are the actions in the Laravel, how we can use them, how we can make them, everything about them, alright. So now let's start. So these are some points of our video. So first of all we will start from uh, very scratch and we will make a component. Then we will use this component with the template. Then we will see what is the action theoretically. Then we have to make function inside the component. Then we will call these functions on a function click on a button click all right so now let's uh, just come on a command line and just write here php artisan that's my bad artisan make live wire and our component name let's say my component name is profile and just hit the enter now it will just asking me to about the repo so I don't need repo so now you can see that we have uh, two files here one inside the HTTP live wire folder which is here and the another one we got inside the live view live wire this is our profile file so what I'm just going to do I'm going to use this on my uh, home page so I'm just going to remove this com component from the welcome dot plate so just remove this all component uh, all code and just write here html5 and we can also remove these things I don't need them and now let's define the three directives one is uh, the rate live wire styles then we have to just use at the rate live wire scripts and here we can also use uh, at the rate live wire and our component name so my component name is profile so just write it here and we did not write anything in the till in the profile load blade so just write here within a h1 tag just write here profile yeah profile component and now let's see what we are getting here okay so we got this text here now let's move on the third point what is the action Ac what are the actions it's my bad yeah, what are the actions so actions are basically the functions inside our component and we call them functions on a button click so basically uh, you can think that how this is possible that we can call a PHP function without Ajax from the HTML button yes in the live wire this is basically possible and we don't need to write any JavaScript code even uh, JavaScript code is handled by the by default in the background in via live wire let's see how this is possible so first of all I am just going to define a property here let's say my property is dollar message or dollar name and by default name can be Peter all right and now I am just going to print this property on my blade template and just write here h2 and just write here dollar message so now you will see we are getting here okay uh, okay this this is the name we define the name here not messages all right so we got a Peter here perfect so now I just want to update it on a button click so now I have a button the name of update name all right so for that I am just going to define a function here and you know function and function name can be update name and here I am just going to put here dollar this name will be Bruce that's great yeah so how we can call this function so for that let's just come inside the blade file and just write here wire click and here you can just call the function name so my function name is update name and I am just going to calling it from here 
so now whenever I am just going to click on a, a update name we will see that we got a bruce here so how this is possible that it got a button without writing a javascript directly called the php uh, there is a magic behind is why the uh, live wire because when you just click on it, this button you will call the profile file and uh, there is a uh, request as well as the response you can see that all right so uh, the ajax request is handled by the live wire that's why we don't need to write any ajax code perfect that's great but uh, can we pass the parameter here also? Yes, we can pass. So let's see. I just want to pass here Tony like this, right? And now I can just quote here dollar name and just simply put here dollar name like this. Refresh it, and now we got the Tony here, right? And here on the every click, you can see that this is a uh, we are sending a next request. So you can see that this is a uh, pretty not well because if we are just going to click again and again the server will getting the lots of load so but that's okay we can manage for it because uh, livewire is also providing some awesome functionalities like uh, you don't need to write even a line of javascript all right so thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and bye bye take care